Hello everyone. Good morning. I am Neelam, your art teacher, and this week we are doing color technique, and we are using two shades of any color like light and dark. So I am drawing some uh, shapes, and uh, here I am using circle for the head of a bird, and now. I have drawn one curve line and one more small curve line and then one more curve line to connect these two lines. This is the one wing of the bird. Now I will draw two more curve lines in leaf shape. So this is the second wing of the bird. Now I have drawn one more uh, curve line, one slant line, and one more curve line to make the tail of the bird. Now we will draw eye. And for I, a circle and a curve line inside the circle, and two small triangles for beak. So this is our bird. Now we will draw one more bird, uh, which is sitting on the ground. And so again, I'm using a circle for head, a bigger circle for head, because we are learning color technique. So we need to draw bigger drawings. and uh, one more uh, curve line or a bigger circle for the body but here i am adding one wing on the right side and for that i am using two curve lines in a leaf shape and on the left side again i am drawing two curve lines or v uh, leaf shape and some lines for the legs or feet and one small triangle for beak and again small circles for eyes and one curve line inside the circle for the eyeballs now the bird is done now we are using the same circle shape to draw one more drawing of a caterpillar so again i will use a circle for head and i will draw five more circles connecting to each other and uh, last one is a little smaller now we will draw again the eyes and the smile of the caterpillar and tentacles eyes will be same and we will draw one curve line for the smile now we will uh, draw legs or feet of the caterpillar so here two circles are in the air and uh, we will draw uh, feet uh, like l shape uh, last three circles on the last three circles like they are uh, touching the ground and in two circle we will draw that uh, like they are in the air Okay now our drawing is done now we will add some more lines to show the background but uh, we will not color the background here we will color these shapes only these birds and caterpillar only and uh, i am drawing one curve line in the center of the sheet uh, it uh, this line is dividing the sheet in two parts now i am drawing the uh, for the upper part one sun because it's a sky area upper part and now i will draw uh, two trees one left side and one right side and i'm uh, using the same shape like for the trunk two curve lines and v shape in the center then one bigger circle for the upper part of the tree now again one curve line v shape and one more curve line and one big circle now our drawing is done now i will show you the color technique and here i am using light green in the center uh, so i am using a lighter shade in the center and then i will use darker shade on the outer side okay so i am uh, outlining the outer part the circle part and then i fill this space with dark green and then i will overlap the light green with dark green so this is the technique in which we are showing lighter center light center and the darker outline 
so we are using two shades light and dark now i am just overlapping or mixing the two shades with a light hand don't give so much pressure and i'm showing you again in which i will use dark green first i will outline the tree and i will uh, color a little uh, circle and leave the center part for light green so you can use both techniques now i will use light green and it should be in circular motion like we are making circle circle and just overlap the dark green that's it this is the technique and you have to follow this technique in every shape like i'm using a uh, pink and red color in bird's wing if you want to paint your bird in other color you can use other color just you have to make uh, your picture colorful and you have to learn this technique of coloring we are mixing two colors darker at the outside and inside in the center we are mixing lighter color so i'm following the same technique in every shape so i want to paint my bird in red color and pink color and in uh, uh, the tail i am reversing the color like i am using lighter color on outside and darker color inside so our technique is to mix the color with two shades okay so you can change it vice versa but i think the uh, when we use darker color outside then it will look very good so you can use that technique and for the face i use the pink color so the choice is totally yours you can fill this picture with the, your choice of color in tree trunk i am using uh, dark brown and light brown dark brown on the Uh, both side at the curve lines and light uh, brown i will use in the center and then i will overlap it it will give a uh, 3d effect and for the sun i am using a, a yellow and orange color here orange outside and yellow inside now we will uh, color the bird and the caterpillar like this and you can um, Use different color. Just make the caterpillar colorful. You can use uh, different color in each circle. Here I am using pink and uh, violet color, rose pink and violet. So like that, you can use any color. Just uh, check which one is the lighter and which one is the darker. so you have to use lighter color in the center and darker color outside hope you like the technique you must try this and try to learn this technique uh, the filling of color with two shades just make it colorful thank you for watching